Have you ever had a really good idea or a lot of things to do that you really had to finish and then suddenly... Why isn't this working? I was so ready to do this just a second ago. I used to have a life. I used to be happy. Where did my brain cells go? Hi, Sky here. Are you sick of being relentlessly bullied by your brain? We've all been there. Having a great time writing a story or painting that one OC we just can't get enough of. When suddenly, you lose the momentum. The spark that you had for your project practically vanishes. Everything associated with your project makes you feel exhausted and frustrated. Well, in today's video, I'm going to be talking about motivations and give some tips on ways to help regain or maintain motivation for projects. So, let's get it started, shall we? This might sound a bit odd, but I find that when I feel really unmotivated to work on something, I try working on something else, whether it be drawing, reading, or just continuing writing a different story. That way, I feel like I'm still using my time to do something productive while giving myself a small break from what I was originally working on. It's sort of like a vacation, running off to a different world to write about. Speaking of break and vacation... Sometimes it's best to slow down and let yourself rest. Step away from your tablet and get something to eat and drink. Then maybe take a walk or a shower. Heck, sleep! Losing motivation makes working on your project feel very draining, so take some time away from it to recharge. That project isn't going anywhere, so take all the time you need. Losing sleep won't really help you think faster, now will it? It's easy to get lost in your thoughts. As ideas evolve, you gradually separate more and more from what originally inspired you to create something. Maybe revisiting the sources of inspiration can help reignite the spark in your project. Why does that character have that hair color again? Right, because it reminded me of a character I was obsessed with at the time. You don't always have to be motivated by things you can see. Music has a way of reaching you in a way that other inspiration can't. Look for songs that fit the vibe of what you're working on, and hopefully it'll inspire you to work more. I like listening to and discovering music through edit audios, but throwing together a playlist of songs you're familiar with can also help set the tone for what you're working on. Pushing yourself is good for when you want to stay on top of things, but try not to push yourself too hard. When running out of motivation, what you used to accomplish every day might feel harder and harder to keep up with. When you feel like you can't keep a consistent workflow, give yourself smaller goals every day instead. It could be correcting something with a drawing or writing a sentence or two. Just something to give you a small taste of what you're working on without making it too overwhelming and stress-inducing when you feel like you aren't getting enough done. One thing that can help you stay motivated is to branch out and share ideas with people who are familiar about the subject you are struggling with. It could be a family member or a friend. Asking for their help or input with what you're having a hard time finding motivation for can help you think more clearly. Letting them have a look at what you're working on can help give you a new perspective and more encouragement to continue working. The trouble you're having might sound more solvable when talking about it out loud to someone who is willing to listen. These tips are mainly based off things that have helped me find motivation when I've had a hard time working on projects. Inspiration tends to get me a pretty long way, but I can understand if that's not how everyone feels. Feel free to comment your own solutions, and if there's something you'd like to elaborate on. Either way, I hope that this video helps someone who needs it. Doing your best can look different every day, and that's okay. Be good to yourself, and good luck on your projects. I be leaving you.